Lisa, get in there. Good to go? Hey guys, Keith over here, Foodie Life TV. We're out down here with the 30A TV at Egg Fest in uh, Pensacola, Florida. I've got Shane next to me here from Manual Shepherd Condon. We're gonna live stream you all the way down this concourse here. I've got Red here, she's gonna help me out because at some point I'm gonna have to shut up. But uh, Shane, why don't you tell us what we made today? Well, we've got Sriracha Chicken. We've got our gourmet chef, Greg Fayard, behind us. This is Greg. He's been slaving since about 6.30 in the morning. I was here with him very early. Galen over here on the team. Alicia off to the side. We're happy to be here at Egg Fest to support Rally. Great cause. Great cause even with the Gators. If I'm wearing this, you know I got fried. All right, we're two and six. I can't complain. So Awesome. All right, so you guys still have food left? Yeah, we have plenty of food left. Okay. All right, Ray, did you try any of this? I did actually try it earlier, and it's absolutely delicious. The sauce is so good and, and spicy and, and saucy and, and a little... It's all good. So get yourselves over here. What? Tell, tell, yeah. us what, tell us what's in it, guys. We got a little honey sriracha lime chicken. Uh, we also have a little... Uh, we, we we're smoking it with some cherry wood, give a little uh, little sweetness, and uh, yeah, having a great time out here. Great event. Always enjoy being here. Are you guys having fun? Are you sure? How many of these did you make? A thousand. You got 995 more to go. Then you should be out of breath by now. <laughs> All right, guys, egg fest. We're gonna keep going. Stand back. Stand back. Okay, so we are here at uh, Wahoo Stadium in Pensacola. We are over here for the for the uh, egg fest, and uh, and I think it should be double meaning. Is anybody serving eggs? No. No, that's just wrong. You have some crappy eggs. Uh, no. Two J's. All the nonprofits are out here. It's a family thing. So okay. It's a friend thing. So. And what are you serving? We've got pork, brisket, and uh, and sausage smoked separately, combined together with a Carolina mustard sauce, ghost pepper cheese, jalapeno, sweet jalapeno roll, and a fried pickle on top. And then for dessert, Kat, what do we have for dessert over here? Yeah, what do we got? We had um, napkins, which are pumpkin and beef with Knob Creek Whiskey. Oh my goodness, that sounds heavenly. All right guys, well good luck today and then keep uh, keep doing the good work. Keep keep it up. Thanks guys. All right, you're next. Pickle. All right, I want a fried pickle. You got an extra fried pickle hanging around? I just want one, just one, just one. All right, all right. Breaded and graham crackers, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's... It's actually really good. All right, what are you eating? Yeah, no, that's why. What are you exactly? It was a brisket slider from uh, Blind Creek. There was it good? Yeah. What did it taste like? Brisket. <laughs> Thanks, man. Spoken, spoken, spoken like a true Genius. smart bleep. <laughs> All right, go for it. What do we got? All right, I know you here. You got to describe what you're making there. So this is an ahi seared ahi with some masago and a little seasoning on it, Inclu including the sesame seeds. Yes, sesame seeds, seaweed, um, the mayonnaise is a Japanese mayonnaise recipe. Really yummy. And who are you guys representing? This is Southern Breeze Barbecue. We are sponsored by IMS Expert Services. Thank you so much for your time. And by the way, I tried one of these earlier. It is absolutely fantastic. That's why I promised this young lady I'd be back with the press. So there you go. Good luck today, guys. A puppy? Do you talk? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay, puppy alert. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, this is gonna go viral. Did you did you ask them if you could yes, give them? Okay, okay. No, no, animals, sure. no animals will harm the pig. <laughs> oh my goodness. How old is this puppy? He's nine. <laughs> now are you guys locals? We, we are, are now. <laughs> you are now transplanted from where? Virginia. And is this your first uh big egg fest? It is. All right, are you having fun? We are. All right. Say it really loud. We love 38 TV. Ready? We, we love 38 TV. We did homemade. We did our own sauce and our own au jus. I want the au jus. Good. Good job, man. All right. Don't let us stop you. Are you enjoying yourself? Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah. The best thing you've had so far. Um, well, the pizza was really good at Pizza Port. There's pizza here? There's pizza way over there on the end. Oh, okay. And the chi the chimichurro, uh, not, what is that, the tenderloin with chimichurro sauce was good. And the peaches and pork was really good. Awesome. And this is good too. It is. This is really good. Okay. Tell everybody how much you love Foodie Life TV. I love what? Foodie? Tell everybody how much you love Foodie Life TV. <laughs> 
I love what he said. Yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go. Down the hall. Who else did you guys talk to? Y'all ready? Where's BJ? This was the big green egg incident I was telling you about. BJ ran off. You want to come back when BJ's here? Yeah? All right, we'll come back. We'll come back. Are we still on? Okay, but we're going to come back. But where do we get the t-shirts? Okay, we just said... We made them ourselves. Oh. You just got to have one. You just got to have them. Green? Okay. Oh. Go this way. All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna come in here while you're cutting up some pork. Who's the chef? Who wants to talk? Just come just come on over here. I'm Red with 38 Television. We're here to talk about what you are serving today. We are making a fantastic 10-hour smoked brisket. We're gonna put it with a custom sauce on a biscuit. Brisket on a biscuit. It's briskets. <laughs> You look like you're but, ducking shrapnel. Did you stay up all night with that 10 hours thinking up that name? Uh, we did not. We had an hour and a half sleep last night uh, preparing for this, so we're uh, rejuvenated. Everything's good to go. And uh, we only have one problem. What's that? We don't know how to spell briskets. Is there a K or no K? B-R-I-S-K-E-T, brisket. Sold it. We bought it. I know. I love it. Thanks, guys. It looks delicious. All right, and who are you representing? We are our team Wicked Slice, and we just do this for fun and raising money for charity. All right, that's awesome, guys. Good luck today. Thank you. On to the next one. Let's chase Keith. Big Green Egg should pay us because, because we're promoting the hell out of them. Big Green Egg, if you can hear me, you need to pay me. <laughs> and me too. Yes, all of us. Guys, what, do you, what have you had so far? You're good. He's better. He's better. I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's all I have, no. Um, the sandwiches over there on the other end are awesome as well. What kind of sandwich? What is like 20 people? It had like got. jelly in it or something. What was it? The peanut butter and jelly? PB&J. You came all the way to a grill out yeah. for PB&J? <laughs> You're live in the world right now. <laughs> right? No, no pressure. All right, so we got a smoked beer can, chicken, white chili. And what we did on our rub is we were based out in a bar. Right. It's girls do barbecue. We do all of our own spices and seasonings. And so the chicken is wearing tongue teaser today. And inside we put a beer from a local brewery in Fort Walton Crops. They did a. They make good stuff. It's delicious. It's a blue Wahoo's blonde. Okay. So it was appropriate for today. All right. So your own rub, white chicken chili, white chicken chili. beer from Fort Walton. It's a totally local dish, huh? All local. You can only get it here. See how that works? Jesse awesome. Marker, Peggy Ducey. We're here cooking for you today. Oh, oh, oh yeah, those are our seasonings. Okay, yeah, so we're the girls do barbecue. Do barbecue. <laughs> we're we're kind of sassy, so all the names of our spices have a little innuendo, like hot to trot, perk it up, getting lucky, and our multi-purpose ones. She gets around. <laughs> I'm, I'm, she's getting lucky today. Hot right. to try. So, is it girlsdobarbecue.com? Yeah, absolutely. I'm going to check it out. Oh, thanks. Check, uh, she won the Oyster Contest last okay. weekend. Can I get a larger size? <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we sell one. Smaller? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, that's for me. <laughs> I, I, I'm thanks for getting this plate. Yeah. yeah, having a great time. You know, I, I, I think I'm better than Emerald with this because, you know, when they tell me yeah. they wanted a little bit. You got a better bam? It's not a bam. Okay, Emerald, if you're listening or watching now, you've been officially challenged. Yeah. Here, Pensacola Egg Fest 2018, we'll see you. It's not a bam, it's a Shazam. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. Come here. Come here. Ooh, you listen so well, I love that in a man. Okay, we are here at the uh, Big Green Egg Festival, the fifth annual at Wahoo Stadium in Pensacola. Talk to me about the Big Green Egg. 
So the Green Egg is just an amazing cooker. It's not just a grill, it's actually an oven. It's also a smoker. You can grill, smoke, bake. I do cupcakes and cookies and pizzas and pies. And smoked cupcakes? Not necessarily smoked cupcakes, grilled cupcakes or baked cupcakes. Oh my goodness. If you've never had a brick oven pizza, it's a brick oven. So you can bake in it just the same way. And there's actually somebody out here I heard doing cupcakes today. I haven't had been around to try them yet. Well, we'll have to get around to that. So now, um. How long have you been on board with the Big Green Egg? We've been doing Green Eggs now for right at 10 years. I've actually been an egghead for a little bit longer than that. I bought my Green Egg and loved it so much I had to become a distributor for them. That's awesome sauce. Now tell us, uh, how much does the smallest one weigh? The little one's about 85 pounds. Okay, and how much does the biggest one weigh? 500 pounds. Okay, and I heard that there was a couple of original ones from the first thousand in this batch, or one or, one or something. So that gigantic one over there is one of the first 1,000 ever made of that particular size. If somebody wants to buy that one, it comes with a plaque and a certificate authenticating it as one of the first 1,000. Awesome sauce. And can you give us a price range from the smallest to the largest? Just yeah. just average. So the small ones are a little bit over $500 for the egg itself, and that big one comes as a package, and it's a little, right, a little over $4,000. That awesome sauce for bacon cupcakes. I'm all in. Um, okay, how do we get a hold of you? So we're down at Escambia Electric Motor, down on Main Street, three blocks west of the stadium. Here the address is 1101 West Main Street, and our phone number is 432-1577. You got a website? We do have a website. Um, but it's best to use our Facebook page because our website's right. pretty bad. And you're okay. Skip the website. Right, it's a good. Now listen, you need to talk to my husband about that. He'll hook you up with a better website. All right. Thank you so much for your time and congratulations on a great festival. Thank you. Thanks, guys. All right. Let's keep going. Let's go eat some more food. Pork royalty. Best shoes. Oh. No, I was wondering why you were looking at mine. We like your shoes. I do. Thank you. They're actually very comfortable. <laughs> now they are. <laughs> you look really weird on me. Are you? Uh, kind of. Yeah, I've been, we've been here about 12 years, so. Yeah, counts, that counts. Enough, right? <laughs> you know where Powell Fox is, right? Yes, I do. You know how to get to the beach? Yeah. You know where the stadium is? Yeah. Alright, you're local. Uh, local That's all it takes. Alright, enjoy your day. You got a little left, man. A little bit. A little bit. Alright, y'all. <laughs> Pretty hard. Yes. You, know, you want to dance too? Yeah. yeah, I know, right? Nice. Yeah. All right. All right, guys. How are you? I'm Keith. Foodie Life TV and 38 TV. How are you? All right, good. What's your name? Tong. Tong? With Tong with Victor Barbecue. Awesome. What did you guys make? We made uh, brisket, boston butt, collard green. Make saw things. corn out here. I mean, yeah, put your corn. foot in it, didn't oh. you? <laughs> you did. <laughs> so, is that all you have left? <laughs> oh, crazy. How many people do you think you guys have fed? It looked good. I'll tell you what, it looked good. It smelled like home, which I like. So, uh, anybody said anything in? Any compliments? What the judges say? Or are you winners? The winners in my book. Of course they did. Nobody else here made collard greens. That was smart. Next Smart, dude. Just do collars, green, just do collars. Yeah. yeah. Smoke the meat, throw it in there, right? Yeah. Call it a day. I, I, would, eat, I would eat it. <laughs> All right. So, uh, it, where do you guys? Where's the, where's the restaurant? Where's the place? Give me some. All catering. All catering. All catering. Yeah. Uh, Victor's Barbecue Catering. He'll come to you. Yeah. Um, Facebook page. Victor's Barbecue. Apparently, websites don't work anymore. We only do Facebook. You're like the fifth person to tell us that. So, cool. Thank you, guys. Jeez. Thank you to get away with it, though. How, why? Because it's so good. Oh, you're a sponsor. Okay. Okay, well, in that case. And give this out. And raise money. Yes, of course. All right. And, and uh, thank you. Yes, thank you so much. And two people just went by eating that and said it was a word I can't use on TV. <laughs> thank you, ladies. Thank you so much for your time. And, 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 and Keith wants one. Okay, now we're going to do this live, so you're going to have to tell us how it tastes. Ready? I've already had three. He's had three? You're about run to run out of it and he's, he's had three? Pam, if you're watching, you should keep approving this every year, just for this, right here. All right, so here we are, Egg Fest 2017. I don't know, what year is it? And uh, this is the fifth annual and they're raising money for Rally, which is uh, to find cancer cures for kids. Yes. So this is a great charity that everyone's doing, so okay. Okay, yeah, see, there you go. Fan, fan assistance? Uh, I hate it when that happens. All right, let's find a couple more. Let's find a couple more. Okay, do you like it? 
this, I, this lady just stuck a microphone in my face. So you're eating a cupcake. I like it. Barbecue cupcake. <laughs> barbecue cupcake. Does it have barbecue in it? And coleslaw. Wow. Where did you get that? We got to get some of that. Right there? All right. That's got to be next day. Right there. Banana pudding. It's a, no, actually, there's a little line. All right, I'll take this. You t- cornbread or do you do straight up cornbread? Sweet or straight up? We use uh, sweet cornbread with it. Um, basically, what you have, you, you said you know, coleslaw inside of that, stuff inside of that, got full pork on top of that. Um, whole combination of North Carolina barbecue sensation. So. What did the judges say? You got a chance? Yeah, just have some extra cash. All right. Let's try one. We want to try one. Let's see. You, you're up this time. I had banana pudding. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, and it was live. Good. Yeah. All right, guys, you win. Cool. All right. The tent with the, the not a few people are down there. All right, y'all. You don't have any left? Oh, well, let's see. We want to see it cooking. It's okay. Ooh, it smells good. We want to be good. This is some uh, smoked salmon right here. We got a Knob Creek maple barbecue kind of combination glaze on top of it. And, uh, yeah, we're the 2 Life 5. We're just a bunch of friends, you know, from Pensacola, born and raised. You just need an excuse to come out and drink and cook on a big green egg? Yeah, yeah. Friends. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. All right. You ready? Sure. Did you get enough? I, Is it good? There's, there's never enough. I know, right? It's all so they've got... That cupcake thing? Holy moly. Yeah? Better than the banana pudding? Oh, you didn't have that, did you? Uh, we'll have to try it on the way back. Yeah. All right, you guys. Foodie Life TV, 38 TV, Egg Fest 2017. Right. Facebook, we're signing off because we've got a lot more to do, and I, I really want to eat. I can't eat and talk at the same time. So thanks for joining us, you guys. Tune in next time. Foodielife.tv. On well, Facebook is just Foodie Life One, the number one. Not to be confused with O N E. Go to Facebook because the website's fairly out of date.